didn't expect the Alliance's dogs to make it this far. G.A. Ravorce! You're going to stop hurting people starting right now! I am merely trying to fulfill the ardent wish of every man, woman, and child on Fargate. The Mu'a who was snatched away from Earth has spent millennia hoping, praying for a way to get back home. So, that warrants an invasion? If a home is all you want, there has to be a better way. The people of Earth have incessantly squandered the resources Mother Nature gave to them. Don't you think it's time they received a taste of their own medicine? Just like the Mu'a did when they were thrown off their homeland. I don't think that's for you to decide. So you want it all to be in some god's hands? If so, I will become that god. I've already laid hands on the creator role here. If being the creator of all things makes you a god, then all that remains is for me to take the throne for myself. We're not gonna stand here and allow that! I fight in order to protect my own life. If you won't even let me do that, then why was I created? I see no point in further discussion. Only the strong survive. The first law of nature, wouldn't you agree? No. Allow me to show you just how insignificant you are. This is tough! Be Allow me to grant requiem to the human race. Yeah. Abyss Cascade! All shall fall into the abyss, even the light of hope! fate and kneel down for your divine purging. Duh, duh, duh. Avenging fist! Seraphic storm! 
Bathe yourself in my light, you bird-ridden maggot. Be still moving! Very <laughs> light! Did we do it? Is he gone? All he wanted was to survive in the end, didn't he? All the power in the world can't help a person overcome a fragile spirit, I suppose. Maybe that's the secret. Maybe you need a weak body to be strong in spirit. Perhaps. When I look at the Rokians, I can't help but hold out some hope for the human race, too. They may not have the technology, but they have the heart. We could learn a lot from them. Thanks for everything, you guys. Oh, hell, I ought to be thanking you. Traveling with all of you is pretty exciting, I gotta admit. Meeting all of you has been one of the most valuable experiences I've ever had. Take care, everyone. I promise I'll never forget any of you. We're friends forever, okay? Goodbye, everyone!
No, I can't end it like this. I can't go back yet. Not until I finish up a little bit of business. What do you mean, Sius? Roddick, I can still remember all the battles we had together. Yeah, we fought everywhere, didn't we? I've got faith in you. I'd let you cover my back anytime. That's why I've got to know exactly how good you are with a sword. Come on, let's go. Right now. All right. You better give me all you got, Sius. Damn straight I will. I ain't expecting to win by going easy on you. Let's go! Air slash! Double slash! Air slash! Air slash! Double slash! Double slash! Air slash! Double slash! Double slash! Double slash! Move a little faster! Moving. You definitely got what it takes. Now I know how much more work I've got left to do. What are you talking about? Didn't you notice how I adopted some of your moves, Sius? That must be why you're so good. You take other people's skills and make them your own. You make it look so easy. I haven't felt this refreshed after a loss in a long time. Have a good one, Roddick. Goodbye, Sius. They're all gone. Elia. Things might have been different if I were born on the same planet as you. Listen, you take care of Millie, all right? Girls like that don't come along every day. You ready, Elia? Yes, uh, just had some personal things I had to say to Roddick, that's all. Hmm. Let's get back to Roke, then. You just watch. I'm gonna become such a famous swordsman, they'll still be talking about me 300 years from now. Stronger than my dad. Stronger than the Crimson Shield, and definitely stronger than you. Got that, Roddick? I suppose that fate just doesn't have it in the cards for us to be reunited. Farewell, my brother. I'd just be bothering you if I pursued you any longer. Excuse me, have you seen a girl around here with wings like mine? Hmm, well you feather folk stick out around here, so I probably would have remembered if I did. I see. There are no leads in this town either. I'm amazed I'm actually talking to people like this. It would have been unthinkable for me just a little while ago. 
Roddick taught me that doubt won't solve anything. You have to have the courage to believe in yourself. Thank you, Roddick. Are you ready? Are you sure this will work? We're talking 300 years here. Of course. You can use symbology to slow time to a virtual standstill. We'll use this sapling to mark the spot then. Do you think they'll notice it? He's pretty dopey about things like that, but Millie ought to notice for him. Guess I'll give him this then. Well, everyone all set then? I guess this is goodbye for good then. Yes, but we may come back for you again. <laughs> Though I'd prefer if we didn't have to. Well, you're certainly welcome. Although, try to make it a more leisurely visit next time. We will. But I think I'd prefer it if Roke stayed an undeveloped civilization. I think so, too. Becoming developed just means your air gets polluted, your water gets contaminated, and your greenery starts to wither. I don't think there's a single good thing about it. Oh, I think there is. For one, we wouldn't have met you. And we wouldn't have had the amazing adventure we had. Don't worry about us. We'll make Roke even better than it was before. When that happens, I'll be sure another visit. Well, see you. We may not see each other again. I'm glad we had the chance to work together. For us, the real adventure begins now.
のぞくやとりぎに」「のこしたいえをもいだし」「でもつながったみちのどこかでまたねあえるきがするから」「よわねはいたってかわれないじぶんもどうもがいたってもどらないかとも」寂しさに朽ちる前に君が示した方へ貫いた石が実ったんだこんな僕でもいけるはずなんだ悲鳴と思いと気配
they're gone. <sighs> they sure are. But there's still something bothering me. What? What was Ilya talking about with you on Planet Sticks? You looked pretty embarrassed, whatever it was. Oh, uh, nothing. Oh, no, you don't. I knew it! She said something weird to you, didn't she? Millie, what are you doing here? Father! Hey, there wasn't a tree here before. Years ago, our friends put this here, and they did this for us!